Okay. Welcome back. We were talking about how out of touch Washington is because I did a few jokes about Barry and Graham and Strom Thurmond. I did. I said Strom Thurmond went to the Vietnam Memorial and said, "Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall." <laughs> These are good. Thank you. you uh, they were, they booed that. They you know what's amazing about it? Here are these guys, right, who play race politics for real, mm -hmm. who are supposed to Thank be running you. the country mm -hmm. and divide people, try to get to the White House off race. You're a comedian. You're allowed to tell jokes. They do it for real, and they get away with it. It is right. really, really terrible. I mean, you said the F word, right, in front of the president? It slipped out. It slipped out. They do it to the president every single day. <laughs> and then they turn on you and say, how dare you say it? The president doesn't like the F word. He, he laughs at <laughs> The word makes him laugh. I noticed that. Yeah. I, I noticed the president, the president was laughing, the president was laughing at your stuff. Thank you very much. But he Hillary was. wasn't. No, Hillary, Hillary wasn't digging you at all. She, she wasn't. I, I don't know. She I was, was digging you. I saw that. <laughs> She was a little bit distracted. There was a little chicken on the lip. I you saw that? <laughs> <laughs> she was. And when you say chicken on the lip. Whoa. <laughs> I, I think we all know what that means. What does it mean? What yeah. happened? No, what is chicken on the no, lip? No, yeah, that's what they serve. Right? They had chicken. Yeah, no, no that, I thought it was veal. But let me tell you what? something. I would, do a, I would do a joke was. about the Republicans and yeah. Clinton would laugh. I would do a joke about the Democrats and Newt Gingrich would laugh. Then I did a joke about Jesse Jackson. They both laughed. They both laughed. <laughs> They both love that one. <laughs> anyway, I was thinking I Washington was out of touch, but they also say Hollywood is out of touch, and I think it's true. This is the headline in today's New York Post. Dave makes Jack gag. Jack <laughs> Nicholson apparently was upset because Dave Letterman at the Oscars did this thing about where he did an impression of Jack Nicholson and he hit a car with a golf club. He was using the wrong club. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to be a wedge. <clears throat> he had a driver. Would no, well, the driver would be the right club, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so my question is, I mean, who is more out of touch, Hollywood or Washington? I think it's oh, a fair question. That's a hard one. Yeah, yeah, it's a toss-up. That's yeah. really tough. I mean, it's the same town, isn't it? Hollywood yeah. and, and D.C. Well, you know well, what I noticed? Oh, I'm sorry. I think yeah. politics is a branch of show business, mm -hmm. if that's what you mean. Well, uh, the, the show business one is, is definitely a branch of politics. Right. True. They're both one industry towns. Uh, Politics and, and show business. They both uh, thrive on power, uh, influence, ego. Um, they're real, it's just that they said, speaking of David Letterman, they said, remember when he moved to 1130? <laughs> power, influence, Remember when, ego. when before Letterman moved to 1130? I'm that segue. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? No, you, you made a segue from the political thing to speaking of Dave did. Letterman, and the audience was laughing, but you didn't realize what they were laughing at. It's because he was talking about... But how about I your own you hypocrisy? Huh? I thought your show was on HBO. It's on, why, why by the way, at 10.15 <laughs> weren't you watching <laughs> my show? The, uh, <laughs> if you had been... It's the Laurie Sanders show here. <laughs> when did you take over? What about a little, uh, <laughs> yeah, what about a little free plug? <laughs> what about a little free plug, my little You're friend? Couldn't <laughs> you have said, well, I know it was between 10 and 10.30 because I was I, watching the Larry Sanders show. <laughs> watching Politically Incorrect with Bill Maher.